The DATAM analysis panel includes a tool named Generate Signal for the generation of signals in the form of sine, rectangle, triangle, and noise. The amplitude, offset, phase shift, number of values, and the sample rate may be specified for all signal types. The frequency may be specified for sine, rectangle, and noise. All generated channels are of type waveform. The following tutorials will generate a signal that simulates acceleration data with DOM minute frequencies at 3 and 40 Hz. This composite signal will be used by the tutorial Differentiate and Integrate. This tutorial will demonstrate how to generate two sign signals. The tutorial that follows will demonstrate how to add those two signals together into a signal channel. The third tutorial will convert the waveform signal to a numeric channel. Clear the data portal, and then create and activate a new channel group named Generate Signal. Activate the Analysis panel, and then from the menu choose Channel Functions, Generate Signal. The Generate Signal dialog will appear. Configure the dialog inputs to match what is shown. Set the signal form to sign, frequency to 3 Hz. Amplitude to 19.6, offset to 0, unit to meters per second squared, phase shift to 0, number of values to 1024, sample rate to 1 kHz, and time unit to seconds. Click the Calculate button to generate the signal. Edit the dialog Generate Signal Control Values to create another sine wave. Set the frequency to 40 Hz and the amplitude to 4.91. When finished, click the Calculate button to generate the signal. Click the Close button to close the dialog. Add the two signals by using the Analysis Add function. From the Analysis panel menu, choose the Basic and then Add menu options. Drag and drop one sign channel from the data portal to the Add dialog channel control labeled First Channel. Drag and drop the second sign channel from the data portal to the Add Dialog Channel Control labeled Other Channels. Click the Calculate button to add the signals, creating a new channel. Close the dialog when finished. A new channel named Added will be created by the Analysis Add function, consisting of the two sign waves superimposed upon each other. Delete the two sign source channels by selecting them and then right-click on them and choosing the pop-up menu option Delete. Rename the waveform channel named Added to Acceleration. Continuing from the prior tutorial's signal generation and Add two signals. Convert the channel acceleration from waveform to numeric by accessing the Analysis panel menu channel functions, and choosing the analysis function numeric channels to waveform channels. Select the conversion mode of waveform channels to numeric channels. Drag and drop the acceleration channel from the data portal to the numeric channels to waveform channels dialog channel input control labeled channels. Make sure the checkbox keep as waveform channels is not checked. Select the Export option of Generate Numeric Channel, Relative Time Reference. Click the Calculate button to perform the conversion. Click the Close button when finished. The waveform channel acceleration in the data portal has now been converted to a numeric channel, and a new channel named Time has been created. The Time channel is a read-only implicit channel. Convert it from implicit to a read, Write Explicit Channel by selecting it in the Data Portal. Then right-click and choose the pop-up menu option Expand Channels. Assign the X relation to the Acceleration Channel by first selecting the Acceleration Channel in the Data Portal, and then accessing the Analysis Panel menu options Channel Functions, Channels to XY Channels. In the Channels to XY Channels dialog, Drag and drop the time channel from the data portal to the channel control in the dialog labeled X channel. If necessary, drag and drop the acceleration channel from the data portal to the dialog channel control labeled Y channels. 
make sure the Conversion Mode option of Create Channel Reference is selected. Click the Calculate button to assign the time channel as the X relation to the Y channel acceleration. Click the dialog close button to close the dialog. The channel's time and acceleration are now both explicit numeric channels, and the acceleration channel X relation is assigned to the time channel. You learned the following in these three tutorials. Datum's signal generation analysis tool makes it easy to generate a signal consisting of a sine, square, or a triangle wave with many configuration options for frequency, amplitude, offset, phase shift, duty cycle, number of values, and sampling rate. You may also generate a random noise channel. Waveform channels may be easily converted to numeric channels using the analysis tool channels to XY channels. Two signals can be added together using the analysis tool named Add.